Russian warplanes have hit Islamic State targets near the Syrian city of Raqqa, the uh, de facto capital of the terror group. Uh, the strike was carried out during the latest of more than 20 missions. Let's show you a video of the bombing released by Russia's defense ministry. It shows Su-34 fighter jets destroying ISIL battle headquarters located in an underground bunker near Raqqa. The city is the main stronghold of the terror group in Syria. We can show you footage. Here it is, a shot from that area last year. That was when Islamic State was parading around its military muscle. And RT's Murad Gazdiev has been taking a closer look now at the fighter jets at a Russian airbase in Syria. We're on the runway at the Latakia base, which hosts uh, the Russian air group. We have two 25 fighter jets taking off now. Those were actually, as they're called, close air support aircraft, Su-25s. They've got a lot of firepower, they fly low, but they're vulnerable to manpads, shoulder-launched anti-aircraft missiles. And Russia's inventory of planes here is actually very varied, and they're suited to uh, different missions. You have the Su-25, for example, then you have the Su-24. It flies high, it packs a lot of punch, and it's very, very fast. But then you've got the Su-34. That's the newest plane on this uh, airfield. It's very new, uh, packed with electronics. It flies high, and it's very, very precise. So everything for any mission. And that was the Su-24 uh, coming in, its payload gone, obviously, after a mission. So the aircraft, again, here, are very varied, suited to different tasks. And here they come, two more. These are Su-30 jets. capable of uh, ground attack operations there at the ground, they mostly focus uh, on air superiority, that is dogfighting or air-to-air -air combat. 